A Whole Systems Approach for World Change. One Community Weekly Progress Update, number 66. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do it yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution creating models in the service of all life on this planet. This includes highest good approaches to food, energy, housing, education, for profit and non profit business creation, society, and true earth stewardship. We are creating all these things to be implementable as either individual components or as complete teacher demonstration villages and hubs. Welcome to the One Community Weekly Progress Update. My name is Jay Sable and I'm the Executive Director of the One Community 501c3 nonprofit organization. This is our weekly progress update number 66, covering our team's progress, accomplishments, uh, all the pictures and details of everything that our team has accomplished for the week of May 26th, 2014. As always, if you would like more details, more pictures, uh, links, specifics to everything that we've accomplished, all the open source content, please visit our written blog. And if you'd like to be added to our newsletter email list to receive an email every time one of these updates comes out to follow our progress more in depth, please send an email to onecommunityupdates at gmail.com. Let's jump into the updates. One community's approach to highest good education is open source and free shared, designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, a learner, teacher, collaborative, and it includes California state education standards. This week, the core team, which consists of the satellite and pioneer members, finished the English subject molecule. Here it is, expanding in the background. We also researched and added another 20% of the links from our math page to the open source and free shared Khan Academy educational program uh, for teaching it all. And this brings us to 60% completion there. And behind the scenes, we finished the happiness themed lesson plan and began the lesson plan with the core theme of signs. If you'd like to help with this education program, we are seeking people to finish these lesson plans. We've got them all outlined and we're just looking for the creative minds who would like to contribute something amazing to the educational world through our open source and free shared education program for all ages and all educational levels. One community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative, and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. This week the core team created the final 3D renders of the complete Aquapini and Wallapini footprint. Here is a series of these images showing this in-ground growing and aquaponics concept that will include six different internal growing environments, recreational spaces, water collection off all the structures, a central water pond for storage, and a central amphitheater for hosting recreational and educational events. We also added the 18 hoop house planting maps to the large scale gardening page, and we finished adding the diversity details to the organic cucumber section of the large scale gardening page. It now offers 10 different varieties of cucumbers from around the world, seven beautifully featured, and complete sourcing details for all these and all the other food plants already on this page. We're also now 50% done with our large scale soil amendment strategy webpage that is open sourcing the specific details of our horticulturist and botanist work for land preparation in areas with poor soil. In this area of the project, we are seeking a master electrician and a master plumber if you would like to help out. The one community approach to highest good housing is eco artistic home building that is affordable sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. This week the core team working on highest good housing finished the earth bag home heating and cooling page outlining our planned dome home heating and cooling strategies. We also began outlining a strategy for crowdfunding the building and complete open source sharing of a three dome home cluster 
and we outlined version 1.0 of our remote internet plan. Lastly, we finished our tank versus tankless water heater comparison research uh, for the Earthbag Village communal showers. In this area of the project, we are seeking a master plumber and a master electrician. If you or someone you know would like to help with this component of our open source creation process. One community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. This week, James Nance of P2S Engineering continued work on the heating plan for the Duplicable City Center. Here are the results of our collaborative outline for all the separate controllable heating zones so we can maximize the efficiency of this building based on use and season. Ben Pollock also made huge progress on the kitchen details, including specifics for the canning and preserving and dishwashing sections, plus all the food serving areas. He also specked out the details for the sprayers, heat boosters, and dishwashers. For this area of the project, we are seeking a structural engineer and a general contractor. The structural engineer is somebody that we're seeking to help us design the cupola so it can be built without a crane, which is very important for our open source goals and duplication anywhere in the world. And the general contractor is needed for assistance in conjunction and collaboration with P2S Engineering, who is helping us with the mechanical, electrical, and plumbing section of this structure. The one community approach to highest good society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, four different economic models, and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet. This week the core team working on the highest good society component completely updated the details of our core value of diversity page covering how diversity is foundational to our organization's world change goals and philosophy and how we use this value in our internal decision making process. One community is using a whole systems approach to world change because we see the challenges that humanity is currently facing as not only interrelated but as interdependent. We see them intimately connected with each other and dependent upon each other for solutions that are going to last. We feel that if the goal is to create positive and permanent global transformation, then a connection between food, energy, housing, education, highest good economics, fulfilled living, and true earth stewardship must be made. And this is what our organization is here to do. This is what we're creating right now. We are open source and free sharing the tools, tutorials, resources, blueprints, and do-it-yourself strategies for highest good of all living and creation. This is our whole systems approach. We know that if we make it easy enough, if we make it affordable enough, and if we can demonstrate the way of living for the highest good of all, that is the consciousness that our entire team is carrying, that our group is putting forward and we are calling out to the makers, the creators, the people who share this consciousness and believe that we are the change we want to see in the world, that one person can make a difference. And that by coming together as people with a common vision can change the world for everyone. We know that if we make it easy enough, affordable enough, and demonstrate it as attractive enough, then this idea will spread on its own. Creating teacher demonstration communities, villages, cities and hubs around the world that will further teach others how to build teacher demonstration communities, villages, cities, and hubs as well. And these teacher demonstration communities, villages, cities, and hubs are designed to be solution models that create additional solution creating models. Taking the resources where they're needed most and empowering people to duplicate the solution strategies in their lives and the lives of others, spreading the idea and creating a sustainable and self-sufficient way of living that can be applied anywhere in the world and help as many people as possible and ultimately reaching that tipping point. The tipping point where it affects everybody and the idea becomes mainstream and the way of life on this planet as we know it now is completely different. It's providing enough for everybody. This is our highest good of all philosophy. This is our highest good of all approach and this is how we are calling out to the makers, to the creators, to the innovators, 
to the people that know that you can make a difference as an individual and that when we come together as a group, we can make an even bigger difference and that the future is completely up to us. People that agree that this idea of a whole systems approach to world change makes sense. And that it's a choice. It's a choice that we can make. We can choose to do this. We can choose to create this. And so one community has created the template. We've created the path. We've created the detailed and very specific approach to creating this global transformation, positive and permanent transformation that will affect every single person and all life on this planet so that we can bring together the people that agree with this. For the people that think this is fun, for the people that think this is a good idea, for the people that want to be a part of making history so that we can offer that as a path and, and invite you to join us, to get involved in what it is that we're creating, to be a part of world change with us, and to add your creativity, your spark, your ingenuity, your brilliance to what it is that we're doing so that we can make it better and better and put it out there. Or to take everything that we're doing and to develop it in a different direction. This is why we're open source and free shared. You don't have to do it our way. Our way isn't the way. It's a way. But we're putting it out there in a format that can be adapted and modified in a way that works best for individuals or other groups too. People ask, what will it take to get one community to the next level? First of all, we're already doing what we're purposed to do. We're already creating open source blueprints, tools, tutorials, resources at a phenomenal rate. We are accomplishing a great deal. But if we want to go to the next level, the next step for us is getting the property off the market. And to make that happen literally only takes one person. It could be that person that connects us to the person that's able, that has the funds and the resources to fund us, either by donating to one community or investing in one community. Or it could be, you could be the individual. You could be the person who's actually capable of doing that. Or connected to the small group organization that's capable of doing that because once we get the property off the market we will be able to exponentially grow our team we will be able to more efficiently create everything that we're creating and take this whole idea of open source and free sharing large-scale solutions that can be applied in the lives of individuals or as the complete teacher demonstration model we'll be able to take this whole idea to a completely new level so we thank the people out there that are connectors. We thank the people that are following our work. We thank the people that are sharing our work. And uh, as always, we are on all the social media networks to make it as easy as possible. We're on LinkedIn. We're on Reddit. We're on Twitter. We are on Facebook. We are on Tumblr. All of these. And we say thank you for following our progress. We invite you to join our newsletter list. If you haven't already, send an email to onecommunityupdates at gmail.com if you'd like to receive an email every time one of these updates come out. Or join, uh, just subscribe to our YouTube channel and you'll get updates as well. And we say thank you to everybody for the small donations as well because we are a group of 100% unpaid volunteers. Everybody that's doing this is doing this for altruistic reasons, doing it because we know that we are the change we wish to see in the world. We realize that even as individuals, we can make a change in the world and that when we come together, we are even more able to affect positive and permanent change. And that's what we're all here to do. So join us if you'd like to. Thank you for following our progress. And until next week, we will keep on keeping on. Thank you.